The three decades of civil war in Sri Lanka caused a massive impact on our socio-economy and environmental ecosystems that led Sri Lanka to be ranked by the Global Innovation Index as one of the least innovative countries in Asia in 2018. Thousands of international aid provided significant support, but imported solutions couldn't solve the fundamental local problems sustainably. Hence, DreamSpace Academy envisioned a self-sustained, advanced, interdisciplinary and accessible platform to address this gap not only on deep science, technology and engineering topics, but also in arts, culture and storytelling. DreamSpace Academy was born in 2018 as a non-profit social enterprise in Sri Lanka to tackle local socio-economic and environmental challenges through challenge-based learning, fostering grassroots innovation and impact venture building, setting out to empower locals to solve a local complex challenge. The DreamSpace life cycle, the personalized empowerment program, is an 18 months long incubation life cycle that consists five stages. Candidate discovery, make education, grassroots innovation, domain expertise, and venture building with access to advanced multidisciplinary accessible platform with funding opportunities. In the first stage, candidate discovery, we discover motivated youngsters through diverse workshops and trainings from underserved communities who has the motivation to become a change maker to solve local socio-economic and environmental challenges. In the second stage, make education, the candidate is trained in anything from photography to biotechnology in our advanced multidisciplinary labs with diverse workshops to lead them to the third stage, grassroots innovation. At the third stage, the candidate's lifelong interest and immediate project are identified and developed as a prototype and demonstrator to solve a complex local challenge. Once the grassroots innovation in the process of development, in the first stage, domain expertise, the candidate's knowledge base is amplified by collaborating with international experts and organizations. Last but not the least, the fifth stage, impact venture. The candidate solution graduated as a startup for socio-economic and environmental development. The results of DreamFace lifecycle is not only a single change maker, but it's enable other change makers to join to create the impact. Our impact ventures and grassroots innovations incubated through DreamSpace lifecycle creates industries that did not even exist in Sri Lanka for the past years. Join our mission to achieve sustainable development goals in Sri Lanka by empowering underserved communities, protecting environmental ecosystem, facilitating peace building and fostering sustainable startups to build the green economy, blue economy and bioeconomy of Sri Lanka. If your startup and innovation development needs to move faster than your imagination, Dream Space Academy is the place to be. Sri Lanka is an island country located in the Indian Ocean. With a blue ecosystem which is approximately 8 times Sri Lanka's land area. The coastline water supports highly productive marine ecosystems and provides a massive economic value to the small nation. To keep our ecosystems safe, secure, clean and sustainable, we need to measure various parameters in real time. Therefore, it's understandable that there is no modern infrastructure in Sri Lanka to measure and monitor the blue ecosystems. Such equipment is very crucial for scientific research and assessment on an ecosystem, which is swiftly changing due to various weather conditions. Our DreamSpace Lifecycle candidate, Sanjivan, developed a solution to protect our oceans. As giving solution, I started building an underwater glider. Underwater glider is an autonomous underwater vehicle which drive in the surface of the water and give us data in the real time, such as pH, water temperature, dissolved oxygen. Underwater glider uses a buoyancy engine to change the mass of the glider, which allows the glider to ascend and descend. And also it uses a very little energy that it can run 
typically months and weeks without recharging. As it drives very slow in the surface, it disturbs the marine ecosystem in a very little basis and it is not that harmful for the marine ecosystem. Initially, I started working on this project as an individual. On one point, I realized I need a community to work on this. There, I co-founded Ocean Biome. Ocean Biome is a community of young ocean advocates to solve the real problems in the ocean ecosystem and motivates the upcoming generation to work with ocean. Now we are on our way to protect the ocean. Let's save ocean together. Do you know styrofoam is one of the biggest public health hazards? The amount of waste coming from styrofoam is comparatively bigger than any other waste products in the world. Styrofoam fills up 30% of total landfills globally. The worst part is that it takes more than 500 years to decompose. During the process, it leaches toxic chemicals to the environment. Dream Space Academy developed a solution to reduce the amount of waste coming from styrofoam. Actually, as a biology student, I learned about fungi, but I wasn't aware of its amazing capabilities until I joined Dream Space. So when I joined Dream Space, I had the opportunity to connect with a global community of fungi growers and enthusiasts. So that's where it all started. After a few months, I started talking about uh, my ideas of growing sustainable material in Sri Lanka with few entrepreneurs. And after those discussions, we launched the startup, the Dream Fungi. In Dream Fungi, we locally research, develop and produce a biocomposite material using mycelium as an alternative sustainable material for packaging, construction, apparel and accessories industries to battle plastic pollution, especially styrofoam. In Dream Fungi, we are focusing on environmental and social impact through biotechnology. We are building a mushroom farmers collective, a collective of existing and upcoming mushroom farmers in Sri Lanka to scale the production of biocomposites and also to elevate underserved farmers from poverty and provide them more employment opportunities. So we imagine a world where local farmers create mycelium products for global market, contributing to a healthier green environment while protecting biodiversity and also generate income for themselves. 